All right, I've gotten a skirt up her hips, yay. <laughs> and now we're just going to push that Velcro tab down really tight. You know, I don't like how that's sitting. It is really tight on her. I don't know, maybe, maybe she's been making some midnight snack runs. I don't know here, or else this outfit's just a little small. All right, because I don't want hair and so forth getting stuck in there, so you want to cover up that part of the Velcro where it's rough. Okay, so I don't know, I like her in the gold. Also the lips on this, I had intended to show um, painting on this. Like I said, I generally use acrylic paint and her lip color was so sheer and translucent that it just really did not work and we ended up having to use um, a different, uh, entirely different solution. So for these arms, getting their arms through are always kind of a challenge, so I like to take paintbrush here and just kind of open that up before I attempt to put her arm in there and that seems to help out tremendously with getting long sleeves on the dolls so and I just do it from both ends I think the problem is there's little threads up in there and their thumb which is open on the hand wants to hang up so let's see how well that goes if that helped if it's really bad, you can always take while you're doing this. Let's see if it'll go through and insert this again and then kind of push from both directions. But I see her hand there. But I can feel the thumbs hanging up. So there we go. Oh, we're through. So that is Experience goes for me here. That was pretty easy. And I'm gonna put this hand back. And I don't have a ring for her, and I don't have the correct crown. I did get a crown. It came with another set of crowns. And it will do the job for now. At least she won't be crownless. And her shoes aren't here yet either, so. Sometimes you just have to be patient in sourcing your needed materials and, you know, not, not paying a fortune for them. But, yeah, I don't know what's going on here. This hand doesn't want to go through, and my hands are just not back up to full, pow full par today because... It's just going to take a while to get them there, but anyway, we'll walk this through in a minute. All right, so she's in an odd position here. She's like, help me, I'm stuck in my jacket. I'm going to open up this little purse, which has more strings, I say, that need to go. Every time I move it, there's another string. I just keep my clippers handy. I'll take that off, and I'm going to put in this little palette here. Because you can't be without your eyeshadow or your compact. You have to be prepared. There. I mean, doesn't that look cute? I think it does. Just add something, and it's gold, and it just has the just a something a little extra touch. And I'm going to hand sew this onto her jacket. I like to. Now listen work with me here. <laughs> it's, the compact fell out. But I'm going to hand sew this on here so it looks like she's actually holding it and she won't drop it then when she's on display. All right. We'll work this hand through and then we'll be back and I'm going to put her little tiara on here. My daughter added some rhinestones on here for me. I asked her to do that and even though this isn't her correct tiara, I think it's really pretty, don't you? I love it. All right. We made it through without any thunder. 